and I just hate the dentist. I hate them. I don't hate them. If you're a dentist, I'm sh we need you. Thank you for your service. Um, just me personally, I'm afraid of going to the dentist. There, I said it. Sugar, bite, and everything nice. Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Joanna in case you don't know. Guys, today I have a very exciting tip. If you struggle with bad breath, if you're prone to cavities, if your family's prone to cavities, if you're prone to like gum disease or if you just need some tips on how to get rid of bad breath and just take care of your overall dental hygiene you need to know about oil pulling it's like an ancient secret that's been around for thousands and thousands of years but my overall teeth have improved greatly this is how I whitened my teeth actually I used to use whitening strips so if you're using whitening strips toss those okay I'm not a doctor this is just personal experience um, I use coconut oil pulling for my overall dental health um, and guys it's actually like a magic secret. I'm surprised not more people know about this or are willing to do it because dental products a lot of them are actually really bad for you and they're full of toxins especially fluoride. You want to avoid fluoride at all costs. Um, I don't care what they say it's bad for you. Um, I'm not a doctor okay but from my personal research I hate fluoride. Um, Anyways, so first, let's, let's just get into this. How did I use this to whiten my teeth? Um, I used to use, uh, let's see, whitening strips, and those are actually so bad for your teeth. I don't know if you guys have used those before, um, but literally, it's like, it can make your teeth really sensitive, and I just knew it was bad for me, but I wanted white teeth, so I was like, whatever. Um, and then, like, you know... Yeah, you would have white teeth for a while and you would just do that every so often and it will whiten your teeth. And then I decided to give oil pulling a try again. I used to do this like every once in a while, but now I try to do it every single day because it's that amazing. It's investing in your teeth. You only get one set of teeth. So this is something that I feel like, you know, you want to take the time to do. You know what I mean? Um, anyway, so all you do, you guys, they say you can use other oils, but I think coconut oil is the best option. And you basically get like a tablespoon, scoop it out of there, put it in your mouth. The thing about coconut oil is it doesn't, um, it doesn't, like I think under like 75, oh 76 degrees it turns into a liquid. So if you keep it kind of a cool environment, it's kind of a lot better. And you put it in your mouth and you let it melt and then you swish it around for 20 minutes like it's mouthwash. And what it does when you do that, it's so crazy. It's, it's crazy like... We really have everything that we need on this earth. You know, it pulls out, um, it takes care of plaque, bad breath, it fights cavities, it dissolves bacteria. So that includes basically even if there are cavities forming, if you already have a cavity, this will, I mean, I can't guarantee it, but it has been known to take away cavities. It's been known to prevent cavities and gums disease and plaque and that stuff on your tongue that gathers, that's, you know, usually people use a scraper for. Um, people really don't have to use that anymore so I sometimes do this twice a day after I brush my teeth and I use a little uh, I floss my teeth and then I do this um, and sometimes I only do it once a day sometimes I miss a day but um, I literally can't go back to life without coconut oil I will use it for the rest of my life this is literally magic in a bottle coconut oil has so many uses but I'm telling you if you're struggling with your teeth it doesn't take long to see whiter teeth um, when I started doing this again, <laughs> I had my friends and family literally all asking me, like, your teeth are so white, what are you doing for your teeth, what are you doing for your teeth? And I was like, I'm just oil pulling. And then I stopped doing it for a while and my teeth went back. Like, they weren't, they weren't, they just became a little less white and I was like, oh my god, this works. So, some people don't like oil pulling because they don't like the feeling of oil in their mouth. And it can be kind of gross, but the thing is, it's so worth it, it's natural, it's very price efficient. It, it's weird because you don't think that'll do it, but it works. That's all I gotta say, it works, I'm sold, my mind is blown. And the thing is guys, you have to spit it out in the trash can. Do not spit it out in your sink, don't spit it out in the shower because 
it will go in the drains and if it gets cold in there it will turn into a solid again and it just makes big problems you have to spit it out in the trash can I know that's kind of gross but you can't spit it out anywhere else or you can spit it out outside somewhere I mean you don't want to actually spit it outside because it's coconut oil but like I mean like in the grass like I live in the country so that's kind of fine for me because I live on a lot of land but if you don't then you know if you live in an apartment or like if you live in a neighborhood you probably don't want to do that to your yard um but yeah guys so pretty much you can get any coconut oil uh it has to be i would get the most natural raw form of coconut oil just because that's the best um and yeah you just want straight up coconut oil you don't want to mix with anything um some people i know will try to mix it in with like you know like some kind of essential oil because I know some people literally can't take, like my best friend, she knows that this works, but she hates the feel of coconut oil in her mouth. And me personally, it doesn't bother me at all. I don't even think it's gross. I mean, you just swish it back and forth between, like you want it to go through your teeth. So you want to like swish it around like that, try to push it forward, push it back. That's why it's called oil pulling and it even pulls stuff out of your skin. The thing that got me into this was actually when I had acne. I did a lot of research and um, I, I know that this can help with that. Honestly, coconut oil can just improve your overall health. I mean, you should probably be taking a spoonful of this and eating it a day anyway or incorporating, incorporating it into your food. Before you cook it, it loses a lot of its health value after you cook it. I just want to say that coconut oil is great for skin. There's just so many uses. Sorry, I have to be like a, a coconut oil uh, maniac, but I am one of them. <laughs> it is what it is. But yeah, guys, I would just highly, highly recommend giving this a shot. And the thing is, though, you have to be consistent with it to see results. So I would say give yourself, I'll take before and after pictures of 30 days. And um, this does not replace brushing, brushing your teeth. You definitely still want to brush your teeth. And I think if you brush your teeth before, it gives more. I, I just think, you know, it's better to do that so you can get most of it off. Your teeth matter, you know? And this is, I think this is only like 15 or $20. And you can pretty much get coconut oil anywhere. Preferably organic. You want to get organic if you can. Um, and yeah, guys, even if you want to take some of this, rub it on your skin and I get some hydration you could do that too yeah that's my little spiel on oil pulling I think it's absolutely like magic like I said I can never go without coconut oil pulling now like and guys even when I notice that I don't do oil pulling my mouth feels gross like it feels like what's the word it feels dirty if that makes sense like it literally feels like it's cleaning out your mouth and um you know like even after you spit it out you can wish it out with water the rest of it um but i noticed like if i forget to do it for a couple days or if i don't have any with me and i'm like staying at a friend's house like i can feel the difference and i have like plaque if i don't do it so it's like it's a very noticeable difference and it helps a lot with bad breath so if you struggle with bad breath like i said that's from bacteria and this destroys bacteria it literally destroys it guys i could rave about this all day no, like, okay i need to chill out but i just want to get on here and share this beautiful gift from the earth seriously i am such a i just love the earth so much i just feel like it's given us all that we need and more and so um I hate going to the dentist. I don't like going to the dentist. It freaks me out. I don't like getting my teeth cleaned. I don't go unless I have to go. And this could probably keep you out of there longer. Because think about if it prevents you from getting a cavity. You won't have to get a root canal. Or if you do have a cavity and you're afraid of getting a root canal, I mean, I would give this a shot before getting the root canal. Like, try it for a few months. Um, yeah, because honestly, sometimes root canals go bad. Like. Sometimes it can cause nerve damage that lasts forever in your mouth. And I just hate the dentist. I hate them. I don't hate them. If you're a dentist, I'm sh we need you. Thank you for your service. Um, just me personally, I'm afraid of going to the dentist. There, I said it. I don't like going there. Like, if I know I have a dentist appointment, I literally dread it leading up to the moment that I have to go in there. So, that's just me. 
Um, guys, if you want to see more tips, like beauty tips and life tips that I use with products, let me know. There's some other things I definitely want to talk about that um, are just as magical as this, if not more. Actually, I don't think I... There's not many things that are more magical than coconut oil. But just let me know. Follow me on Instagram if you want to keep up with my life. And yeah, guys, I just want to say thank you for all the love and support. And thank you for subscribing. I will see you in my next video. Bye.